In today's video from Sam4SL, we're going to demonstrate how to restore um, a TILF programming from an SD card backup on the ER900 series of registers. So in this video, I'm using the 940. The process should be the same on all the machines across the range. Um, bit of a disclaimer coming up first. If you've just stumbled across this video, stop watching. Um, you should only be carrying out this sort of procedure if you A, know what you're doing, or B, you've been specifically advised to by your cash register dealer. Um, so you might be, you might have developed a problem with a machine that you've had to perform the RAM clear and memory allocation, and then now you want to restore the program, or you're programming a second tail perhaps, um, and you've copied it, copied the program from the first tail, which is actually what I'm doing in this video and then um, downloading the information. The, the restore will only work if you've got the correct memory allocation performed. So you will have been advised by your dealer what memory allocation to set up and you will need to have already carried that out. Okay, so also just another disclaimer, we can't really help you. This is, I'm showing you how to do this on this machine and I can't necessarily support it if it goes wrong, if you see what I mean. I'm just showing you the process and um, hopefully it'll work. Okay, so that's my uh, disclaimer out of the way. Uh, the first thing to do is you'll need the service key. I mean, if you're in this procedure already, if you're this far into the program and you'll, you'll know the basics, you'll need the service key, which is the metal key marked C. You need to turn it round to the service position, which is where you will have um, performed the... I need to log in actually then. I log in key around to service yeah you, you build in service mode a on the first machine to or on this machine when you've backed up the data to start with and then when you've performed the memory allocation and ram clear as well um, so the next thing you'll need you may have already done this but i'm going to show you how to do it you may already have the sd card loaded from when you've saved the um, program the first time round. so the S, if not the sd card's located here or the sd card slot you just need a Phillips screwdriver, a small one, to access the SD card slot. So this is my SD card with my uh, correct information on it. So I'll pop that in there. So this card has been formatted, in a, which I've shown you how to do in a previous video, and has had the program restored to it from either this till or another till. This till has had the correct memory allocation loaded. If not, it's going to error when I try this. So, but now we're ready to go. We've got the SD card loaded. We turn the key, or turn the till on first of all. Turn the till round to the service mode, and then type in 110, followed by the subtotal key. And then now the machine will uh, it'll either error if I've set the memory allocation incorrectly or I've put in the wrong SD card, or if I've done everything right, it'll now restore the program. So I'm expecting when this is finished to be able to sell a pint of Worthy and so on and so on. So that's it performed. You get a little printout come out to confirm that everything's been restored. Then you turn the key back to reg. Ideally, you would now remove the C key because you don't want anyone accidentally going into the service mode because it's an engineer and service mode only and you can cause yourself some significant problems in that mode. Uh, so pop the reg key back in and what you should find is that your program has been loaded and the till will now work exactly as the first till did or that the till did before you had the problem. Okay, I hope that video has been helpful. Uh, we've got plenty of other videos showing you a lot more basic stuff on how to change prices and, and use the 900 series. Some of those will be appearing on screen now. You're welcome to watch those. You can also subscribe to this YouTube channel or visit sam4shelp.co.uk for more. Thanks for watching.